Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft from the Hermitcraft server. I am here on the other island, and we're not going to actually do anything on this island today. We're getting close, though. I'm preparing some ideas. There's a lot of zombies headed towards me. I'm preparing some ideas, and I have some thoughts on things that I want to do. Whoa, that guy just ducked right in time. I'm also sick. I don't know if you guys can hear it in my voice. I'm trying to mask it as much as possible. I took a, a bunch of uh, medicine, and uh, and hopefully it helps a little bit. Uh, but I've got a little bit of a cold, maybe a flu. I can't tell the difference anymore. It always seems like it's the same thing nowadays. What do I have in these furnaces, by the way? Oh! Oh, that's, well, that's okay. We got golden carrots on us. And we got a whole bunch of this. Okay. All right. So, I have made the, um, the rail all the way over here. Oh, that's the sound I'm hearing. He's still in there, that guy. I've made the rail all the way over here, guys. And um, we're getting ready to go back. Now, let me just show you something absolutely unbelievable. It's so unbelievable, in fact, that you guys might not believe it. I have invented the fastest way. I haven't invented it. Let's just say I stumbled upon... I stumbled upon the fastest way to travel from place to place. Yes, it does use minecarts. Oh, that's what I wanted to get. I need to get a button here. Um, hmm, let's go get a button. So, let me just explain to you. This is just like the biggest stroke of luck ever. These right here, these are the key to it all. And I've tried it with uh, with different levels of durability. And it seems like that is the durability that it has to have. So the boots have a leather boots, a durability of 29 out of 65. And let me just show you what happens. Oh. Daisy's barking at something. Let me just show you what happens when you hop in a minecart while wearing these boots, okay? It's gonna be amazing. You're not gonna believe me, but trust me, it's all real. I know, the anticipation is building. Ouch, what the heck, guy? Uh, the anticipation is building. You guys are very, very excited about this, and I can tell, I can tell that you're excited about it. I can feel the energy emanating from you guys. We're gonna make minecarts great again. Here we go. Perfect. Okay, let's put this thing down. Where is it at? Now, you put on these boots. Okay? You put on these boots. You get in here, and now watch how fast this minecart ride goes. Oh, here. Let me turn on the uh, the thing so you guys can see the, the blocks. The blocks moving. Ready? I, I left-clicked. Ready? <laughs> Woo! Man, how about that trick, guys? That is like, that is some inside information right there. You guys, oh my gosh, you guys need to like get yourselves some leather boots with a durability of 29 and everything will be okay. One stack of red sand for a diamond? What? No. Four stacks of sand for one di Why is regular sand so much cheaper? Four stacks of dirt for a diamond. Two stacks of gravel for a diamond. One stack of red sand for a diamond. Well, dang. I'm going to need a bunch of this red sand, so let's uh, let's maybe buy... I don't even have the inventory space. Let me just throw out some stuff here. Mm -hmm. Let's go over here. You know, a creeper just blew up on me a little while ago. D don't throw these away. These are super valuable. Oh, my gosh. Uh, I guess I could throw those away. We will throw this away. I will keep this, and I keep these. How much space do we have? One, two, three... 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 diamonds we're about to spend. 13 diamonds. Okay, let's take the diamonds out first. Unbelievable. These these red sand prices are outrageous. Outrageous, I tells you. So we got 13 diamonds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Right? One, two, three, four, five. Uh, I, I, I looked away for a second. Five. That's 11. Okay. 13 diamonds. Unbelievable. Outrageous. Maybe we made some money back with our quartz shop. This quartz shop is beautiful. Ooh, I should like take note of the landscape. I want to work on the landscape today. Oh, yes. I'm going to need a bunch of these. Okay. And then just some regular sand. Yeah, that's going to be fine. Although in, in, in my base, I replaced this with like the orange glass, which looks a little bit better. But I kind of like, I think maybe in a small situation, this is better. I don't know. I guess I could go over here and replace all the orange uh, carpet with orange glass. But we're not going to do that. We're going to accept the fact that we have orange carpet here. Oh, baby. This is so much. But Hermit Cam left the game. Hermit Cam, why are you cheating, bro? 
Uh, okay, definitely here. Let's put this right over here. We can't lose these ever. 29 durability. That's the key here. And then we got 27. So we just spent 13 diamonds, but we made 27. So we're 14 up. Tango joined the game. Hello. Um, yeah, let's go back to our base and start doing a little bit of, um, of terraforming. And I also kind of, maybe if we have time, oh, this is the place that it blew up, by the way. The creeper blew up on me, and I don't have the blocks to fix it. Oh, it's driving me crazy. Wait, how can we fix this? We need to fix this. Um, junk. Maybe there's some, like, dirt or, or, or clay or something in the junk folder. Folder? Junk folder? <laughs> this is not an email server. Okay, that's kind of helping. Is there dirt over there? There was one dirt. Ugh, crap. And it was coarse dirt. I don't even think they use coarse. I got to remember to come back here and fix this. I don't even know how it was. I'm guessing there's like some some slabs here and uh, and some and some grass and stuff. Yeah, you know what? I blame them. I blame them for not lighting this place up properly. Let us begin. First of all, I wanted like a, a couple of hills here on the side of the base. Like the sand is pushing up against it. So that's what we're going to be doing. Nothing too crazy. I guess I could save some sand by not actually placing any underneath and just covering it up. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. And now let's do some more over here. <laughs> I'm expecting it to stick up there. That's not how sand works in this game, guy. Uh, and then we'll do this. I just said I can save some sand by not placing any underneath, but I just decided that I'm not going to do that today. Okay. Now maybe let's have a bigger pile right here. Um, right by the lift. The car lift. Boom. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And there goes an entire stack of sand right off the bat. I'm. This is going to be bad. I'm going to need more of this sand. Rendog's going to put his kids through college uh, <laughs> with the, all the sand that I buy from him. Let's see how that looks. See if we need any more. Oh, we definitely need more. I think we got to, like, cover the whole side. Can I... Crap. Uh, let me get some shears. Guys, I heard her voice. <gasps> There's a little baby guy. Oh, he's a black... There's two of them! Uh-oh. Neither one of them are farmers. Is that guy a farmer? That guy's a farmer. I think that guy's a farmer. He's a farmer, right? He's the brown coat guy, so he can, like, farm and stuff. And he can, like, reproduce the babies, I hope. Although, now I don't know if there are enough, like, uh, doors for them to keep... Playing. <laughs> playing? Keep reproducing. This is gonna be a long, painstaking process for me. Especially since I like to actually do things and redo things over and over again so I'm, I'm sort of uh basing it on the fact that the uh the wind is possibly blowing in this direct oh my god that's already like two two or three stacks i've wasted already my goodness uh basically blowing in this direction like it's blowing from the side but a little bit to here that's why you see this sort of shape mostly uh i think that's gonna be okay so let's, I mean, I think I'm satisfied with that for now. Let's fill up these gaps that we have that Iskal made and didn't leave us the sand for. Mm -hmm. um, you know what? That's okay, I guess. Yeah, yeah, we'll leave. I mean, we want, we want some unevenness. I don't want this to be all flat. So let's just fill in these parts and fill in the water over there. And then we'll, uh, we'll work on doing some other things. I can't remember if I got some more... Um, of these or not or if I've already wasted them I may have already wasted them my goodness we're gonna have to buy so much more sand I think what I'll do is I will cover the water and the lava with um with cobble and then put the sand directly on top so that it kind of still looks like a little bit of a crater um and a natural crater too because I'm not really getting rid of anything right I'm just putting uh, should I leave that Let's try it like that. So we'll only put we'll only put cobble one layer high, if you guys know what I'm saying. And then we'll put the sand directly on top of the cobble. <clears throat> Excuse me, and see how that looks. I apologize for my sickness. Um, okay, let's try this. We're close. Three more. All right. That's all cobble. Now, let's try to replace, or not replace, replace and repeal Obamacare. Let's try to, man, I've been so much, I've been falling asleep to political podcasts now. <laughs> it's like the only way I can fall asleep. Let's see what this looks like. So put a piece of sand over every bit of clay so that no clay is visible for now. 
and then we'll we'll figure out a little bit more detailed things later. That's actually pretty good. Let's leave that. All right. Let's do this. My goodness, I'm going to need so much of this red. I don't think I can go back and buy more red sand. I have to find um, a place that has red sand because I'm going to go broke. Maybe I can work out some sort of a mass purchase agreement with uh, Rendog. I think it's Rendog's shop. I think it was Rendog's shop. Okay, so let's do that. This, uh, we will cover this one up like so. How's that look? That looks pretty good. I like it. It looks all natural and stuff. Let's do the same for this. However, um, I think I'm going to have to replace and repeal these blocks. <laughs> I can't stop saying it. All right, let's do that. All right, I've covered up all of the water uh, holes and the lava holes that were here. This looks a little bit odd. Let me just smooth this out a little bit. That's okay. That still looks very, very sort of busy down there. And that's a little bit better. Okay, so it's looking pretty good. I've also removed a lot of these dead bushes. I don't want there to be that many. There was a lot of them before. This cave here, I think we're going to have to cover up. Um, I mean, it's nothing special. It's just like, yeah, it just goes up to the other side. So what I think I'm going to do is cover this. I'm all, This is all the sand I have left, by the way. That's it. Just under uh, two stacks. Um, let me do this to cover it up. And then we're going to start working on... Well, actually, I don't think we can work on a little bit more terraforming. Like, I wanted to start using the sandstone and stuff to put little holes and indentations in the in the dirt and give it a little bit more texture. But I don't have enough sand, and I refuse to pay these outrageous prices. Outrageous prices for these for this sand. So, uh, I'm going to have to work out a deal with... I believe it was Rendog's shop. I, I actually didn't take note on whose shop it was. But, yeah, I think it was Rendog. See, this is, this is good stuff right here. This is good stuff. But we don't want it all together like this. So, you know what? Let's take advantage of it. Let's mine it up. Okay. Mining it up is not going to be a good idea. Um, No, not you. Or not there. There we go. Alrighty. Well, let's just fill in this. I mean, we're going to end up with more sand automatically. Because when we remove sand to put in, like, sandstone, we're going to get that sand back, obviously. So... It's not, a, it's not the end of the world. There we go. Look at that. Look at you. Looking all good and stuff. I need to put a torch or a uh, glowstone there. But it's looking nice. I also um, filled in the bottom. If you guys remember, there used to be like a huge pit right here. And I finally filled it in. So now we no longer have the huge pit. It's looking good. Looking good. Let me see if I have any more glowstone. I have 21. That is not a lot. Well, I can make more. I have 35. That is not a lot of glowstone. Do I have any more glass? 28. There's glass paints. Oh, more red sand. Oh, red sandstone. Oh, red sand. I like that. At least that could... Oh, oh! <laughs> All these wonderful discoveries. I don't think we have any actual glass, though. Like a full stack of glass. No, we don't. So maybe I will go and grab some... Do we even have orange dye? No. Oh, man. Life is rough. Here, I need these torches. This terraforming is going to be a long process. In the meantime, let's work on some other things. I've got some chests. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I want to start putting some chests in, uh, in my base here. I still have to fix this door. Dang it, I keep forgetting. So, we have a lot of space right here. And this is the place where we have the rock samples on the walls. Um, so why don't we put a couple chests, like, they don't have to be even either. Let's put, like, a couple there, uh, maybe a trapped chest next to one of these things, and we'll put some signs on them, and this is where we'll keep all of our stone. Maybe I'll even put one back here. That's actually not bad, right? Just three like that? Oh, and one on the shelf. Let's do one on the shelf. Maybe we can keep, like, books or potions or something here. Um, we have this blank wall, which I don't know what to do yet. I'm gonna work on this today as well. I want to get this fixed. Now, there is a way... To have this um, iron doors, iron trap doors, we just have to use pistons, which I might do in the future, actually. We're not going to work on this, though. We're going to work on this. Um, we got to have, like, a um, just a monitoring station. I like this here, but I think I'm going to start moving some things. Okay, you know what? Let's start with this, actually. I want to put a block. We didn't even bring... Oh, there it is. Good. I thought I had one in here. Let's go ahead and make some stairs because I want to have, this is like our central command station. 
for this room, for this room alone, because this is this is this is important stuff. We're growing plants on another planet. Our temperature, yeah, sure. Uh, we have this thing. Hmm, I'm wondering if that's too far forward. No, that's fine. We're gonna actually break these off. I'm gonna put a traditional computer, and we're gonna use these as monitors for something else. So we're gonna need what? Uh, a, a stone, stone, stone pressure plate and then a painting, and then we'll start constructing. Yeah, this monitor is a little too far forward here. Let's just let's just break you off. Come on, guys, pop off. There we go. Let me get the things I'm gonna need, and then we're gonna get started, and this is gonna be beautiful. Here's the basic outline of our observation station. Wow, that's a nice widescreen. Ooh, that'd be kind of cool, have a big widescreen monitor, but no, because um, we only have one wide seat, and it's gonna look really, really weird. I don't know, I think a widescreen, if it was like, Oh, come on. Are you serious right now? There we go. Oh, look, it's greenish, too. Perfect. We're monitoring the uh, the photosynthesis. <laughs> we'll use uh, a gray pressure plate for this keyboard. I'm thinking maybe we'll have two keyboards. There's we, there we go. There's our one keyboard. Now we have to have systems analysis data or something. Um, let's put that there, and we'll have uh, this on there. Okay, so we have that. Now we need some monitors. Uh, right, this monitor isn't going to work over here. What we're going to do is I wanted to have one here. Oh, we need to copy. We need to copy these banners. I only have two. There's a bunch of different designs that you can do too, but I only decided that these were the ones that I wanted. Um, so what's a banner like? Just like this? Is that what it is? Yes. I think you need the same base color. Yeah, there we go. Okay. You just need the same base color, and then you can copy them over and over again. So let's do another one. This time we'll do the blue. And I think that's going to be enough. I don't think we need that many. So let's place this monitor here. So there, there's a monitor. We could even put another one like right here. Oh, yeah. This is beautiful. I like it. So we have two more. We'll put a blue one there. We'll put a green one there. Nice. Oh, this looks like, this looks good. I like this. Now we can't put the pressure plate there. So should we maybe try putting a pressure plate somewhere else? What if we did it here? There's just a random pressure plate there. Sure, we can weigh fruits and vegetables there. That's what that's for. It's a weighing of the fruits and the vegetables. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. There we go. We have a little, we have a secondary laptop. This one's monitoring the situation. We can like type on two different things. <laughs> Somebody actually tweeted me a really cool design where the top of, um, so you put chainmail helmet on an armor stand and then the top of the helmet, sorry, you push a block on top of it and then the top of the helmet just sticks through and it looks kind of like a keyboard and it's actually a really cool design. I don't have a chainmail helmet, so I can't really... Um, do uh, anything like that, but a uh, very awesome design. I might try it in the future We need like lighting here Because all I have right now is torches. Let me go get some sea lanterns. I'm thinking we have this space back here I'm thinking we got to make use of this space somehow Probably honestly just lighting Is what we'll put in this corner. Maybe put lighting on all four corners and then um, Maybe some track lighting up above that might be kind of cool I'm going to put them in uh, different spots. So at the front, we'll put them one block in, which would give us a little bit more coverage. Oh, that's going to look terrible. Terrible. Oh, that's terrible. You know what? I've been meaning to do this, too. I don't like the way... I don't like how close it is to the wall. It feels like there's, like, no walkway. So I'm actually going to just break this entire row of beats, and we're going to replace it. We're going to repeal and replace. I can't stop saying that. We're going to replace it with a row of quartz. And that should fix our problem, at least a little bit of it. Now let's put this bad boy under there. And let's put a couple of these right there. And we'll do this. And, ooh, we want that. Ah, oh, I wasn't able to grab it. It's too late now. It's gone forever. And then we'll put, put that down like so. All right. So now we have two on the corners. Now, what I could do, and what I will do, I believe, is replace these as well. Oh, no. Uh, here, let's, let's, let's get this going here so that this water doesn't go crazy on us. Like I said, I'm going to remove the water. I mean, I think I've said that before. I'm going to remove the water because uh, we don't need this much water. I don't think we're going to need the water. 
um, when we decide to do the auto farm. Speaking of which, this is a perfect spot to store some things. We'll put a chest there. We'll put a chest on the floor. And then maybe another chest. Um, hmm. Hold on. Hold on. We'll put another chest right here. But we'll use a different set of stairs. Just so that it looks a little bit different. It still looks like shelving, right? Still looks like shelving. Perfect. That's nice. That is nice. Do you guys like it? I like the fact that it's a little bit different. I, I don't I don't hate that. Could we even maybe do this? To leave one. Let's break this one, actually. This one seems to be throwing me off a little bit. That's pretty good. Okay, and we could put our, uh, our crops and a uh, hoe in here somewhere. That'd be good. And we have our monitoring station here, which looks amazing. We have this that we need, we need to finish still. Let's uh, break that. Break that. Okay. And now, oh my goodness. Oh, speaking of which, why not just start the process right now? Here are some beets and beetroot seeds. Pick up some of this stuff. We will put potatoes, carrots, whatever. I'll, I'll, I'll organize them later. Um, we have golden carrots, too. That's for us to eat. Okay, let's break this block. Um, right, mate? Let's put this block down here. I have two of these left. Okay, let's put... Oh, dang it. Dang it. Here, let's just do this. <laughs> I'm just trying to find a way to put these down. Without having to actually go in there. There we go. And now we'll put this. And we'll put the white glass again. Looking good. Looking good. I know this is not going to be enough lighting. Should we put the other one in here? I feel like we should put the other one in here. What is the angle on this one? I don't think I have any more of these guys right here. But we do have some of this that we can put down. Like so. Okay. I think that's pretty much it. I think I want some more detail along the side here, but I'm not sure what to do. Um, I did have an idea that it might it might look good, it might look terrible. Let's try this. So I kind of wanted like lighting above the farm. Now, one, two, three, four, five, six, it's a six wide farm. So let's do one here and one here. Yeah, let's do that and now um what block should i use so the idea is to have like a rod of light coming over and i'm going to use the end rods obviously i don't even know i do have enough i think and so let's see where this lines up to this lines up to the oh yeah this lines up with the glass so not exactly how i planned um I don't want to do it down from the bottom. Here, let me just show you guys what I have in mind. Where is... Oh, dang it. I keep picking it up when I don't need to pick it up. Oh, and I also should mention that all these science, all these uh, chests are going to have s labels on them. Let me just go label these real quick so I don't forget. Oh, man. I feel terrible today. What is going on with my, with my body? There we go. And then I'll bring over the stuff off camera because that's, like, super boring. Um, hmm. Hmm. I think we need white. As much as I hate to say it, I think we need to make these white, which means, yay, more quartz. <laughs> oh, man, I run through quartz. I'd love to know how much quartz I've I've uh, used on this project. So we'll do this. And then I kind of wanted to do... How am I going to do this? Uh, here, this is, this is what we'll do. Like that. Okay. Is this going to even look decent? It's just something I'm, like, toying with. Uh, it's not terrible. You know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sleep on this. I'm going to sleep on this. Because I think I need a nap after today. I'm, like, exhausted. My body, my body's like, no, don't record. Just sleep. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to be doing, probably, in a, in a little bit. Hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. I really love this little information station, as I'm calling it. We got to put something back here. It doesn't look like the light 
actually carries here. So I'm a little worried. We could just do this in the corner. Just that it's, it's something, right? It's something. It could be our antenna for the machines, right? No, maybe not. Yeah, I still not, I'm still not quite done with this room. I've got to like figure out a little a little more something for the walls. I don't. I wouldn't mind. You know what? I might fill or not fill it, but I might decorate a wall or two with just a bunch of paintings. Um, the ones that are singular like this that look like crops. <laughs> that might be good. I might even try to trap something behind glass like have some crops just like i have the rock wall here have a little bit of a crop wall huh a crop wall that might be kind of cool anyway thank you guys so much for watching leave your ideas in the comments leave your screenshots on the twitters so i can see them don't forget to put the push the like button because i'm sick and i deserve it uh hope you guys enjoyed this episode see you next time bye bye for those of you that haven't caught on yet i was totally trolling you with the uh fast minecart thing i just sped up the video